guys, welcome back to KB Wrestling. I'm KB Wrestling, or you can call me Kyle. And today is November 1st, 2017. Total Divas comes back tonight. NXT on tonight. And, uh, yeah, it's just a great day. Tomorrow, November 2nd, though, my birthday. I'm going to be the big 1-8, 18. Uh, but I'd just like to say also thank you. Everyone, my Adam Blompe video has 2.5k, 2.5 thousand, not 5,000, 2,500 something, uh, views. Thank you, and total views altogether for every video I've posted, 7,700 something, almost 8,000. You guys rock, thank you, and, um. Yeah, let's get into the video. This video is going to be my SmackDown Live review, and at the end, I'm going to talk about something. Uh, a recent thing Triple H has done. I'll add a photo to it near the end. So, uh, let's get into this. SmackDown Live started with Shane McMahon talking. He uh, was talking about when they invaded Raw, when Raw had Dan Bryan on, and Dan Bryan got choked on by Kane. Shane McMahon was like, oh, we're going to destroy Raw at Survivor Series, yada, yada. And so far, we know Randy Orton's on the team. Shane drops a bombshell and says he is the team captain. So, so far at this point, we have Shane McMahon and Randy Orton on the team for SmackDown as the Survivor Series. But that changes throughout the night because now, after that, it was Bobby Roode versus Dolph Ziggler in a 2 out 3 falls match, a rubber match. Um, the match is very good. I, it's very good. I liked it. Um, it was Bobby Roode got the... No. Dolph Ziggler got the first fall, then during a commercial break, but they had it up in the corner, you could watch it during the commercial, Bobby Roode scored the second fall. So, ultimately, there's one fall left to win the match. They went back and forth, it was really great, both of them tried to roll each other up, Dolph hit Bobby with a zigzag, he kicked out, Dolph went for the famous there, but then... Bobby Roode rolled him up, and then thought he was going to go for the pin, but no, brought him back up, and... Boom! Glorious DDT. One, two, three. Bobby Roode wins the match, beating Dolph Ziggler to two out of three falls. He says, hashtag under siege in his interview with Renee Young. Because now, he just won a spot on Team SmackDown. So now it's Shane McMahon, Randy Orton, and the glorious Bobby Roode so far for Team SmackDown. To verse Raw Survivor Series. And keep in mind, we also knew now it's... So right now, it's Kurt Angle and Braun Strowman for Team Raw. And Team SmackDown's Shane, Randy, and Bobby Roode. It's shaping up to be great teams on both sides so far. Now, it's Big E versus Rusev. Rusev stepped on Big E's Halloween candy. It was Halloween last night. And Big E got mad, so Big E and Rusev had a match. Rusev won because any English helped him distract Big E and uh, gave Rusev the win. So next week, it's AJ Styles versus Rusev. And the winner of that joins Team SmackDown. I can't wait to see who wins. And also speaking of AJ, he had a match against one of the Sing brothers. And he obviously won quick with a style clash. But then after Ginger Mahal got in the ring, just went to town on him. Beat him up, finished him, and almost Brock Lesnar style. He did call it out Brock too, like, like we all know. Him versus Brock at Survivor Series. Now after that, it was... The, oh, um, we find out next week, uh, Chad Gable and Shelton Benjamin get their title shots. They're going versus the Usos in a tag team title match. I kind of hope they win. I, I like them. They're a cool team. And it'll be cool to have, see Shelton Benjamin win another title in WWE alongside Chad Gable. And we had the Fashion Files, but this time it was Stranger Things. It said Stranger Things. It was funny. They made a mock of Eleven from the show. I watched um, episode one today of Stranger Things. Very awesome. I liked it. I can't wait to watch more. But uh, they were making a parody of that. And then at the end, it was funny. Because I, I actually had saw Jigsaw earlier in the day yesterday. And then at the end of that, they have Billy, which is Jigsaw's puppet. Pretty much a Billy of their own on the Fashion Files. And in the background, it just starts laughing. But in the background, there's Bludgeon Brothers with the lights from... Stranger Things around and blinking. So it's there after um, Brizongo and everyone got attacked. So they're pretty much foreshadowing saying maybe the Bludgeon Brothers, Luke Harper, and Eric Rowan beat down the fas fashion police. 
And, uh, oh, all right, so main event time, pretty much, it, oh, no, uh, it, I think it was, there, uh, no, there wasn't an Divas match, I think, I might be missing some stuff, sorry, guys, if I do, but main event, Shinsuke Nakamura versus Kevin Owens, and the winner goes to Team SmackDown for Survivor Series. Throughout the, uh, match, really good back and forth. Sami Zayn ends up coming up to try to help Kevin Owens. And he is going nuts. Um, but Shinsuke is doing good fighting him off. But uh, Sami eventually takes the announce table apart. I kind of... Um, he should be more careful, I guess I should want to say. And more vigilant, maybe. Or just be careful all around. Because he, the tabletop, he throws it. It hits a fan in the face. He hit a fan last night. By accident, but still, I hope that fan's alright. He got hit with the table right in the face. But, uh, I hope he's doing good. But when Sami Zayn did that, Randy Orton came out to help Shinsuke. And he, what he did to the side brothers, um, that one time, he kind of did to Sami, but not as bad. He did that, and the table didn't break, but, um, Sami was on the table. Um, Kevin Owens almost pinned Shinsuke, but when Shinsuke got back up, hit him down, and then one, two, three, King Shaska hits him with King Shaska, and then the real one, two, three gets the pin and wins. So now, at Survivor Series, it's Braun Strowman and Kurt Angle so far for Team Raw versus so far for Team SmackDown, Shane McMahon, Randy Orton, Bobby Roode, and Shinsuke Nakamura. We just need one more guy. I can't wait to find out who it is. I hope it's... Oh, I mean, hey, it's maybe, I know they lost, but maybe it's, it could be Sami Zayn or uh, Kevin Owens. Never know. Um, Who could it be? I'm trying to think. I hope it's good, though. Oh, yeah, that's right. We're going to find out next week. I'm, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. It's either going to be R Rusev or AJ Styles. So, I kind of hope it's AJ. It'll be a cool team to have Shane, Randy, Bobby Roode. Uh, Shinsuke and AJ Styles that would be a very good team and definitely make it hard for Raw even though they do have Braun Strowman but uh, alright the special thing for tonight about Triple H is he was at another live event with Raw for Glasgow and he teamed up with the Shield I, okay don't get me wrong I don't know if it was last night could have been today I just started today but um, he was teaming with the Shield Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose in a, I guess, three-on-three three match, tag match. I don't know who they were versing, but Triple H actually came out decked out in shell gear, just like Kurt Angle was. Pretty cool. Um, It's cool to see that. So what, is everyone now just going to come out with shell and uh, be the Roman Reigns, I guess? But it was cool to see Triple H, and that just brings the question, is he going to join Team Raw? That will be cool. I can't wait to see if he comes back. If he comes back, I wonder when. And, uh... Yeah, that's really, I'll include a picture right now. Alright guys, yeah, as you can see, that's Triple H right there in, um, in between Seth and Dean. But, uh, yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for the views, like I said before, it means a lot. Please continue to watch. Please subscribe. Um... But yeah, please like, share, and subscribe my videos, please. And uh, if you do already, thank you very much. It means a lot. And uh, yeah, you guys are awesome. So that's it for this video. Remember, guys, it's YouTube. Stay drama-free.